I'm infinite levels above you, huh? None of you touching me. Okay. Yo, I know you see that title. What's up, y'all? We back. We finna play Fierce to Fathom Woodbury Getaway. That shit just dropped like recently and I saw people playing it left and right, left and right. And I was like, oh no, I haven't even done the other ones and this one is going crazy. So we're gonna do this. We'll catch up uh, to this uh, later down the line. Listen, I only had enough money to get this one, okay? Let me just go ahead and face it like that. So we're gonna go ahead and get to this. Oh my God, Ray LL, will you back please? First of all, first of all, first of all, before I even get into this, Go run up the sleeping dogs. We started the sleeping dog series. What are y'all doing? We getting crazy in Hong Kong. Like, come on now, man. Wait, Shan, waiting for y'all. Let's go ahead and cause some havoc together, bro. And then also, I saw somebody said, I just seen this on the internet randomly. It was like the last Fierce to Fathom episode. I hope that ain't true. Ray LL, your games are crazy. I've seen people play your games before. I played the first one for, before. They're crazy. I hope there's more to offer than like, you know, I hope there, you have more in store. Okay. Let's just jump into this. Let's just jump into this. Yeah. <laughs> New game. Ooh, let's go. Let's go. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Fierce to Fathom, episode five. I'm going to act like I'm dead. Woodbury Getaway. December 8th. Okay, cubicle job. That scenery nice. Needed coffee to get. I didn't see. Fuck. I'm already. I'm already messing up. Okay. Let's take a look at this. Hold on. Ooh. Okay. Ain't hit that turn hard as hell. People walking. I wonder if there's any Easter eggs. Probably not, because there's different stories. But that'd be nice. Wait, what the? Ye oh. Oh, this is cool. This is cool. This is cool. I like this. I like this a lot. Okay, we got chips, energy drinks. You want a coffee though? Hands ain't full no more. You need a water? Oh, okay. You know? Uh huh, uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Normal day at work, you know. It's late though. Yes, sir. Let's go. Oh, I need to put a lid on. Where the lid at? Where the lid? Where the lid? Where's the lid? Am I tripping? See, oh. Nope, that's not a lid. The lid, the lid, the lid, the lid, the lid. There. Boom. That's it. Oh, yeah. We needed to use the restroom. Oh, my God. Now put the cup back. Put the cup down then. You're taking it into the bathroom? Are you crazy? Okay, where the bathroom at? Restrooms, okay. Y'all not here typing? Oh, I can't go that far. Does the city still reach out from here? I hope it does. Oh yeah, that's nice. See, okay, so I'm, what are cubicle jobs usually? Are they tech support usually? Like, what, what, what requires a cubicle job? Like, like, I, answer me that. In the call. I'm genuinely confused. Am I a man or a woman? That sip sounded womanly, but like, let's try man. Oh, do I gotta keep drinking? Oh. Okay, so I'm a woman. I was right. That uh, that, that that sip was is kind of womanly. Can I see myself? No, I can't see myself. Boo. Okay. 
Drinking in the bathroom is fucking crazy. Please use the bathroom. I had to put the toy. Oh, yeah. My fault. Could My bad. Okay. This is kind of foul. <laughs> where, where are the footsteps coming? Okay. Get up. Oh, fuck! Already. Oh. Oh. You freak ass nigga. Did I just break my. Hold on. Okay, there. <laughs> I'm so sorry, ma'am. I didn't know you were in here. Ugh. It's okay, man. I like to clean late because it's pretty quiet at this hour. There you go, huh? Yeah. You young folks sure do put in the hours. Make sure to take care of yourself. You too, man. Oh, fuck. We need to start yet. God, get me out of here, please. Oh, shit. That scenery is still nice. It's Mike. What up, Mike? I've been trying to call yourself for the last two hours. It just keeps going to voicemail. Is everything all right? I mean... Oh, snap. I was starting to think maybe you were ignoring me. <laughs> uh, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah, um, Mike. What the hell? Uh, anyway, uh, what are you still doing at work? It's getting kind of late. Damn, Art, that sounds rough. Good thing I called to cheer you up. Um, okay. About our trip, did you get a chance to book the rental house? Just really wanted to see you. And no worries, Harper, I don't want to stress you out. As long as you book it tonight, I think it'll be fine. No problem, Mike. Hey, I was thinking, since we both live in the city, maybe I could pick you up and ride together. It'd be nice to catch up. You know, save on gas and relive the good old days. Just a little bit of Mike and Sydney time before Nora gets there. You know what? Great. Nice. Uh, I What's guess up? I'll let you get back to work then. Oh, uh, wait, one more thing. When you book the rental, please make sure to keep it under $100 a night. Nora and I were talking and she's been on a pretty tight budget. Things haven't been going very well for her. No problem. It'll be just like the old college days. You always had a knack for finding the best spots. Right, right, of course. Sorry for yapping. Really? I'm just excited, I guess. Yeah, you know, freaky. All right, talk to you later, Harp. All right, see you, man. Nigga ain't funny getting none of this. Okay, uh, I know my voice is all fucked up from that early yell. Oh, browser. I can't say anything. I'm typing random stuff and it just goes to this. All right. Rentacabin.com. Okay. <clears throat> uh, where are you going? Woodbury. Woodbury. But cap. Nope. He said under, 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 under. 99 is kind of cool, you know. Oh, brother. Okay. Three guys, two beds, two beds, 50. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, hey, I'm assuming you get hundreds, if not thousands, of stories sent daily.
So I'll give you a basic rundown of something that happened to me. Oh, we started now. I'm sorry if some of it is written weird, but I was rushed. When I was in my early 20s, I worked at a big consulting firm in my city. Life at the firm was a constant juggle of deadlines, client meetings, and trying to prove my worth, which didn't leave much room for leisure, let alone a social life. The job paid well, sure, but at the expense of my mental peace. I'm Sydney Harper, and this story takes place during one of those days. One of my college friends, Mike, suggested that we take a weekend getaway at rural Vermont, which sounded like a perfect break from the cycle of work. And my other friend, Nora, was quick to jump on board as well. The plan was simple. We rent a small cabin, close our shift early on Friday, leave, and be back on Monday. Mike came to pick me up. Two days later. Is that Mike? You a nigga, Mike? Big Mike, yes, sir. Boy, that grin kind of nasty. Oh, that's not Mike. How do I answer it? How do I answer it? Hey. Okay. I can't. I forgot my... How do I open? Pulling in the garage now. You down? Mike, there was a nigga just staring at me. I thought that was you. No, Mike is a Caucasian, man. Ew, Mike, you ugly. <laughs> That's still how you hug people? Take it or leave it, nigga. Why don't you hug me like you missed me? Just a test hug to see if you smelled first. Damn, yeah, on his ass. Fair enough, but for the record, I showered just for the occasion. Nothing is too good for Sydney Harper. Go ahead and make it feel cool. You feel me? You look good. Thanks for picking me up. That's crazy. No, Mike, you look like someone slapped the fuck out your uh, right side of your face, so all the side of your shit just went to the left. <laughs> I'm sorry. This could be somebody's actual face, and I'm over here talking mess. I apologize. <laughs> oh, fuck it. So do you, Mike. You could just throw your stuff in the back, and we'll get on our way. All right. Mike, there was a black man staring at me, by the way. I just want you to know that. All right, then. Harp, are we ready to hit the road? Where's Nora? To meet us there. The route through the city would have been a detour for her anyway. All right, then, Harp. Damn. It was starting to snow. <clears throat> My bad. <laughs> it was starting to snow. You know? This was actually a gift from my coworker, Ricky. Said he found it at the garage sale. So reminded him I could see the resemblance and fuck with him. It's the cowboy spirit, I guess. Boy, this scenery is nice. good Harp, isn't it weird we used to dream about escaping our college and now here we are trying to escape from the life we wanted to live you know maybe we just didn't know how much the real world would you know suck sometimes that's real change is hard just like trying to adjust to the new job Speaking of jobs, how's it going so far? Rick! We're working on this project that uses machine learning to predict market trends. It's pretty cutting edge stuff. Sounds like you're shaping the future. Not quite Tony Stark yet, but I'll take it. You know, you ain't ever gonna reach my goal. Sorry. 
What the fuck? Did you see that? Did I see what? See what? There was a school bus. Maybe it's a project. You know, someone's idea of turning it into a tiny home on wheels or something. I've read people do that on the internet. I ain't talking to you no more. We good. You know? Oh, shit. Alright. I want to say it was closed. I came out of nowhere, yeah. You know. I read on the internet that in Native American lore, seeing a deer cross your path is like getting a message from the universe. Here we go with this shit. Okay. Nigga, dot, dot, dot. Because, like, fuck was that? Like, come on now. Turn on the radio. It's quiet, nigga. Play some drill or something. My bad. That's crazy. Should be about an hour and a half from here. I say that, you know. Driving through the snow kind of feels like we're traveling through the intergalactic space. <clears throat> yeah, I know an artist that goes like in a similar fashion, you know. He he fucks with that type of stuff. He's he might be weird though. His name's Galactic Gray. He he does weird shit like that. He speaks on shit like that a lot. But what do you mean by are you weird like him? Look at the way the snowflakes swirl around the headlights. It's like stars and galaxy rush. Oh, oh, stop speaking to me like that. My bad, that's crazy. It's kind of beautiful. And then he looked over here. And then it just fades to black. As he drugged me. My bad, that's crazy. <laughs> Five fourteen PM. Okay. Why did the ambience change like that? Nigga, where are we? Yo, Harp, check that out. Check what out. Okay, Moe's. Where Nora at though? You know, Harp, I gotta tell you, these new GPS systems are something else. This pizzeria is exactly where it appeared on my GPS. No shit. I'm so hungry, I think I could eat a whole pizza myself. Me too, shit. Big back, me. Okay, alright then, Harp. Operation Pizza Pit Shop. Oh, pit. Oh, pit. What the fuck? Operation. <laughs> oh, Operation Pizza Pit Stop is a go. Prepare to land. <laughs> Get the fuck out, boo. God damn, dude. Okay. Uh, hey, though, where Nora at? Watch Nora not even be in, on this trip. He just used this as an opportunity to kidnap me because I'm not like feeling what he, what type of timing he on. Come on in, Harp. Thank you. This just in. Reports of a strong snowstorm coming towards Woodbury. The tonight. fuck? Residents are recommended to stay indoors and keep. Is that Queso? Let's check in with our field reporter. How's the weather out there, Phil? Oh, it's so cold out here. I, I can't feel my hands. Okay, like uh, the studio should have really brought some snow gear instead of buying that new coffee machine. Is that? I'm sure you'll be fine. I know that ain't who I you think it is. You can have some coffee when you get back to the studio. Jerry, you cannot be serious. You know my doctor said not to drink any caffeine. Sounds like someone's having a okay, bad so day. Okay, so maybe you should. <laughs> I'm cool. leaning on Dante. You little shit. Why can't you? Go out here and deal with the snow instead it's of Dante. me. It's Dante. It's Dante. It has to be Dante. Somewhere nice. Listen, Phil. I'm just uh -oh. clearly the better looking one. You can worry about where you'll report once you get that rhinoplasty. Yo. Rhinoplasty. Why would I need rhinoplasty? My face looks perfectly fine. You could also use some Botox while you're at it. Actually, oh. maybe you should just work as a studio light engineer behind the camera. Damn. I think it would be better field of work for you. you oh my God. Your job because your sister works at the mixing. Board. Oh. You would have never been able to work here if it wasn't for her. I'd like to see you work the ENG sometime. Okay. How dare you? I'm a certified news anchor. Certified. Yeah, my ass. Okay. You didn't <laughs> shit. How about I come by the studio and we settle this like men? Oh yeah. shit. 
Well, let's do it, punk. Yes, sir. We'll be right back after this commercial break. Oh, shit. Are you exhausted and desperately need a break? Oh, they Is were about to go at it. stressing you out? Take a vacation with rentacabin.com. We offer thousands How do I use the phone, by the way? Because, like, I'm getting messages and, and shit. I just crouched on accident. Enjoy I'm probably like a clown here. And uh, uh, tab? Nope. Cabins. Cap, shift? Nope. Now, not only are these cabins cheap, Q? but they're also nope. safe. With each cabin phone? having a designated nope. caretaker to it's ensure fine. that your stay is top notch. What's up? Did you buy the pizza or what? Evening, folks. Look like the colds got everyone craving pizza tonight. You fine, folks. Know what you want to eat? Okay. I fucked up on his accent. Speaking. We'll get three slices each. I'll go with pepperoni, cheese, and a veggie. And for you, miss. Uh. Give me that pep. Give me. The most special. And give me the cheese. Any drinks for you folks? That should cover us. Just the pizza today, thanks. All right then, six hot slices coming right up. That'll be twenty-two fifty. I got you. <laughs> I got the money. Your order number is twenty-seven. Just grab a seat, and we'll call you when your pizza is ready. Got you, bro. Got you. The fuck was that noise behind me? Look around. What the fuck were you doing? Boy, your truck need a, a wash, rust remover. Your truck looked like it was in that crowd of cars when Light McQueen was promoting that stain rust remover. That's that's what it looked like. Yeah. Your truck looked like it was in that crowd when he was promoting Rusty's, for real. Actually, to be honest, I feel like if you were in that universe, you would be your truck. I ain't gonna lie to you, fam. I'm sorry. I gotta stop, bro. I gotta stop. What is that? Is he okay? Um, is that what, uh, it's... It, is that what it looks like when people are on that, uh, the... What is the new drug called? Um, Galaxy Gas? Alright, let's see, man. <laughs> Let's see. What's up, bro? Oh, what the fuck? Long sniff is nasty. It smells so good in here. I'm not for the long sniff with you, nigga. Oh, it's escape to read messages. Okay. I'm so sorry, guys. Let me read. Oh. Oh, you guys fuck? are going to hate me. I swear, I'll get on the road as soon as I can. But something last minute popped up. Why I'm not going to bore you with all the details. Familiar. The long and short of it is one of my clients needs a last minute change. Their payments are about the only thing keeping the lights on. I hate to leave so late, but I've got to keep them happy. I'll have this logo done before you know it and be on my way. Uh, I'm so sorry. Nora, please be careful. I hate that you're leaving so late. Drive slow and don't worry. I'll make sure Harp stays up to let you in. Ew. Now, what was going on here? Nearly 5 p.m. I haven't received a confirmation text from you. I just wanted to check in and make sure everything is okay. The roads near Woodbury can be a little dangerous. If you're not from the area, please let me know when you arrive. Thanks, Rick. We're on our way and should be around 6 p.m. Yeah, and should be there around 6 p.m. The snow slowed us down quite a bit. Thanks for checking in. Okay, please confirm to check in. I did you listen to Nora's voice message? Yeah. Looks like she'll be late. That's a bummer. Guess we'll have to start the fun without her. What can we do? Don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about. What the fuck? Oh, hell no. 
Order to number 27, your folk, you folks are right here. What? Please, because you're a weirdo. I'll just take that shit. Let's, can we just go? All right, you folks are all set. Thank you. I'm not sitting with you. After that, oh my god, I got to. Okay, that's the cheese. Oh damn, this pizza slugs. Where the fuck did you get this like also urban speech out of nowhere? I feel like in my head, like my head cannon for your voice, you sound like Fred from Scooby Doo. Can't believe Nora is missing out on this bomb ass pizza. Oh my god, I hate this nigga. <laughs> oh shit. Hell yeah. Oh, I kind of fuck with the most special way. I see mushrooms. Oh, wait, I see anchovies, I think. Pepperoni. Cheese, of course. Okay. I might be the weirdo, because why the fuck am I eating it like this? I didn't realize I had to keep biting this. So I just bit all three of them at the same time. Eat the crust, too. Some folks don't fuck with the crust. What the fuck? Hey there, my friends. Uh, yo. I I saw y'all pull in a driving. Wait, wait, wait. I saw y'all pull in driving that nice old truck. Uh, are you just watching who pulls in and taking those, nigga? Like, I'm going to just say that's right. And they my truck. Not to be a bother or anything, but I was heading down. Oh, the God. Seems like we might have been going the same direction. Y'all mind if I hitch a ride with you? Where are you heading, bro? Just heading where the road takes me. I'm a bit of an adventurer, just hiking the trails and seeing the country. So... No, sure, fine. Hold on a second. Don't you think we need to discuss this? Isn't that what we're doing? Sure, feel free to... Yeah, man, jump in, nigga. It's your truck. I'm not sure if we have extra space for another passenger. Yeah, he's right. Only two... Oh, God. Surely you can find just a little bit of room for me. I can ride in the middle. Hell, I'll ride in the bed. It's my friend's car. I'm sorry. We would give you a ride, but there is it. It's my... Yeah. You got to be shitting me, lady. No space. I know there's a middle seat. You scared of me or something? I'm sorry. You ain't too kind, are you? Unkind people meet unkindness themselves. You would best be careful out there. Was that a threat, nigga? I'll put your ass under that truck. Fuck is you talking about? Right, like, you better stand up. Hold on. Are you threatening us? No, no, no. Y'all got me all wrong. Sorry, I'm just cold and tired as all. And you can freeze to death, nigga. Fuck. All I eat is warm pizza in your face. Are you serious? How are you gonna let a stranger ride with us in the middle? Of Man, uh, he, he's... Bro, oh, I was just trying to help. My fault. Yeah, well, sometimes helping can put you in a bad situation. He seemed harmless, nigga. You really never know these days. For all we know, he could have been another Ted Bundy harp. Nigga, you seem like Dahmer. You seem obsessed. What is you talking about? I'm just gonna eat this damn harp. You actually eat the crust? You know what? Right, it's kind of wasteful, nigga. I guess, but you wouldn't really eat the peel of an orange, would you? Man, I'm just not talking to you, bitch. I'm telling you, kids like you, man. Kids like you. Matter of fact, uh, bitch. Ah, to put in your damn truck. Holy shit, that was good. Yeah, you ain't got no manners, nigga, because you out here yelling and cursing and shit. Shut up. Are we all right then? Are you ready to hit the road? Maybe we can beat the worst of the snow. Are we close? Give me the keys. Give me the keys. Harp, the weather is awful. Why don't you drive part of the way on? I'm going to drive so you can get a break. I take take a break while I drive, Michael. I'm afraid of what kind of break you're going to give me, Harp. You'll be afraid if you don't give me the keys. Real. Give me the keys. Fine, but there's one condition. What, nigga? I get first choice of bedrooms when or if we get there. Say that. Give me them keys. We outside. 
Dude's probably gonna walk. Something told me some freak ass nigga was gonna be around here. Hold on. Oh, fuck. Come on, let's go. I got you, bro. I got you, bro. I got you, bro. Shush. Shush. Shut your ass. Oh, what's up now? What's up? Come on. Put me in the game, coach. Five forty nine PM. Yeah, we whipping. Yes, sir. Hey, 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 hey. We driving, we driving. First snowfall of the season. There's nothing like a perfect song to set the mood. So here's a track that will make you feel right at home. Coming up next, be sincere and ultimate. Stay warm and stay tuned. Man, change that shit. Let's put some real shit on. Let's go. Yes, sir. Oh, shit. Bitch, fuck you. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. Yes, sir. We outside. Uh oh. What's it a turn? Right, Yeah. Spamming that horn for real. Just cool, you know? Warning. Yeah. Yeah. He's stopping. Warning. He's stopping. Yeah. Okay. You can break them this time to go wild and show the planet how we're ready oh, to rage. Oh, 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 oh,
What a great place. I knew we could count on you. It smells nice, you know? Right? But I really need to hit the john. Take your time, though. While I'm gone, can you pass these groceries away? Oh, put these groceries away. Should be enough space in the fridge. I got it. No problem. Where the groceries at, though? The house was cozy, well furnished. Checked in. Enter the cabin. I just got an achievement. Where the groceries at? He said groceries like... Is there food in the, 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 the thing? In the truck? I can go outside. What groceries? Can I just get back in this truck and just drive off? I can. I'll be back. Time to go for a joyride. Yes, sir. We whip it. We whip it. Whip it. Whip it. We whip it. We whip. Oh, now that I think about it, let me turn the fuck around. Because what if I just left? The I did leave the door open. But what if he get bodied because I'm gone now? Hold on. Let me turn him, bro. Let me put his hoofy back in the driveway. Hold on. Wait a minute. Oh, are they in this cooler? They're probably in this cooler. I had to open the cooler first. Oh, shit. Perfect. Best milk. Sure. Another thing of best milk. But that ain't everything. Bell peppers. Whew. Sunny Grove, you know. Peak Farms, bell peppers, all right. Eggs, okay. Lettuce, okay. Frozen yogurt, just one. All right, we good. Damn, Mike. Woo, sorry about that, Heart. You good? Long drive and all that pizza really did a number on me. Well, all the groceries are put away. Thanks for handling that, Heart. Anyway, this place looks crazy nice. Uh, It's got that rustic charm you just don't see anymore. Yeah, it's cute, you know. I'm just playing, I got this. For sure. Hey, I really need to pee. I'll be back. You can go ahead. I'll start unpacking our bags. Appreciate it. It's about to be some freak shit. Watch. The smell alone told me pizza had really done a number on Mike. Oh, fuck. You could have waited a little bit, maybe. This is about to be some foul shit, but some foul shit about to unfold. Text Rick, but we here, bro. Okay. I'm a brace for impact because I feel like he about to ha. Ah. I hate to admit it, but I didn't want feeling better, much better now. I want to check it. Um, go ahead, want to check out the house. Sounds good to me. Let's see what this place has to offer after you. Hold on. Oh, get your ew. Move, Mike. Come on, let's go. Why am I all of a sudden faster? What the hell going on? All right. Okay. Oh, shit. Mike, you don't see him? Mike, I know you see him. Mike. Mike, turn around, bro. What are you, unk? Nigga, who are you? Welcome to my home sweet home. Ew. 
What a lovely young couple. No, no, no. We are, bro. We are not a couple, bro. Don't look at me like that. You didn't have to sell it that hard, Harp. I was just answering his question. Damn. He didn't ask a question, Sydney. He made a statement and you, never mind. Yeah, shut your head ass up. Whoopsie daisy, silly me. Didn't mean to cause a stir with you two. We didn't expect anyone to be here, bro. Oh, uh, I was out looking for my cat earlier and I remember the TV has been on the fritz here. Just thought I'd stop by and try to get it working again. Since the last few folks left a bad word for it. You know, they say treat your guests like family. My family doesn't go without a TV. Right. Speaking of that, now that your folks are here, let me show you around my sweet home. Right now? I'd be a bad owner if I didn't give you the ground tour. Okay. We got you, bro. Host was middle aged man with a nervous energy. Right from the start, his presence made us uncomfortable. Don't stare at me. All right, here's your shower. That that, yeah, that thing will make you feel like you're bathing under a waterfall in the Amazon jungle. Oh, this thing doesn't work, unfortunately. Not to worry, I'll get it fixed for you real soon. Let me show you the other bedroom now. Okay. Whoa, that was nasty. Look, Harp, this room has a nice-ass view. You think that's nice, mister? Wait till I show you the deck. Hey, yo. Follow me now, please. Yo ass is getting your ass kicked out after he leaves. When he leaves, I'm fucking you up, nigga. Oh yeah, this hard. This place hard. I, I love the, like. A, well, I never did any crazy shit like that, but a, a house party would be hard as fuck right here. Holy smoke, this is incredible. Definitely glad your folks like it. This is one of my favorite spots. The view of the creek is beautiful. It's a great spot for fishing too. All right, folks, let's head back in before I catch the cold here again. Yeah, this is nice have a group of people for a party here you know and it's performing on here yeah that'd be hard why are you staring like that oh that's why here's the storage room if you need anything tools extra blankets whatnot it's all in here if the power ever goes out you can use this flashlight here on my right storms like these you know you never know Appreciate you. All right, folks, let's head downstairs now. Boy, your TV, that TV up. Hold on, man. Hold on one second. Cut that shit off. Fuck. Ugh, what the hell? What the fuck is you doing in the refrigerator? All righty, folks. I see you already stocked up the fridge with some tasty food. You see the knob, turn the knob up for more cooling and down to cool it off. Cool off, I don't know. I tend to keep it low in the winter. The bill gets out of control. Speaking of winter, I better show you folks the water heater. All right, say that, let me know. You went, you, oh. He just like you, he a freak. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Um, nothing to worry about down here. Just the water heater and some old storage stuff. If it ever stops working, just hit the button at the bottom. The pilot light will fire right up and you'll be back in business. Back in business. What's this shit say? I'm being nosy. Uh, hey, sir, what's the deal with that room over there? Nothing you two need to concern yourselves with. I kind of use this basement as storage. Renters don't need the space. They really ought to keep upstairs. Okay, well, uh, I was just curious. Let's move on, man. Come on now. Y'all tweaking. 
fuck was that question? You asking for? Oh, hi. What's up, bro? Did I mention? Well, no. Maybe I ought to keep it to myself. Uh-uh. Speak your mind. The fella I bought this house from, well, told me his mother died down here. Some guests have reported hearing voices at night. Said they could hear something shuffling around down here. Not to scare you folks, but if I were one of you, I wouldn't really step down here. Like, right? Like, nigga? Also, you, you nigga, your lips crusty, bitch. Okay. <laughs> the looks on your faces. <laughs> <laughs> Come on now, I'm just joking. At this point, my creep meter was quietly pinging around a 6 out of 10. I walked up to this. Is that a nigga? Oh, it's not. Okay. I was about to say... Alrighty, folks. Snow's starting to pick up. I'm gonna hit the road now. Gotta find that damn cat. Appreciate you for showing us around, man. You know, although you. By the way, what was that in the window? What was the name on that booking? I must be getting old. Here, Sydney. Ha, huh, Sydney. That's right. A pretty name for a pretty girl. Ew. There's somebody in the window. Move! Is it just me or that dude is super weird? Very weird. Anyway, let's go see if there's any good on TV. Actually, I'm going to take a quick shower. Cool. I'll find something to watch while you're in there. <laughs> Let me know if it feels like you're under a waterfall. Ah, uh, what a weird guy. See you in a bit, bro. Make sure the truck I. What was that shit? Had to make sure. Oh, they want me to shower upstairs? No! Oh, fuck, man. Okay. Let's go ahead and go upstairs. She about to get her doonies beat the fuck up. All these open ass doors. Alright. Damn. Shaboom. Shaboom. You know? Nice little shower, you know? Didn't use no soap or nothing. It was just a water bath. That nigga's gonna be right there on some free shit. I can feel it. Brace for impact. Oh. What the fuck are you doing with that fishing pole? Hey, Harp. Check this out. I found this fishing rod in that shed. Planning to catch dinner then? Now that you mentioned, that would be a pretty epic addition to the trip. I don't know. It's cold out there. Let's do it. I'm not being stuck in this house. Come on. Hell yeah. Follow me. There's another rod in the shed, so we can both give it a shot. Bet. Say that. You say, you say nothing but a word. I don't trust this damn house. Come on, Harp. It's this way. Nick, you always do that. I'm paranoid. Come on, Harp, is this way? I know. Damn, I got the tour like you got the tour, nigga. I saw. Bet. Do you want to grab the other fishing rod, Harp? Yeah, just give me a sec, bro. Just want to look around. Wait, get close. Okay. 
Okay. Alright, where the other fishing rod are you lying to me so you can keep me trapped in here forever, huh? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Not in front of you, bucko. You got me fucked up. Where the other one? Where is it? You got it. Do you want to grab the... Yes, yes, yes. Where is that? Oh, behind you. You were hiding it? Come on, let's go. Oh, snap. I saw a killer recipe for baked carp. Boy, that hook is about to snatch your shit. We'll need to catch three carp, though. You up for the challenge? Yes, sir. Well, first things first. We need to find... Yeah, we need the right bait for the carp. Check out this bait for information board. Okay. Whenever you are ready, grab a carp bait and let's head to the creek. We're going to catch some carp heart. That was so, that was so nasty. Just let me grab the fucking bait. Oh, your weird ass. Okay. Uh, crank bait. Crank bait? Oh, it's maggot bait, cheese bait, sweet corn, frozen ponds. Uh, large mouth bass. Nah. Ten. Common carp, cheese delight. Cheese delight, sweet corn. Cheese delight. All right, we good. Whenever you're ready, grab the cart bait and let's head to the creek. Let's go. I'm ready, shit. What are you waiting for? Okay. Get that never mind, he doesn't know. Breaking for the wall. Alright, bro, let's go. Let's get into this shit. Let's go. This scenery nice and I love those fairy lights. I think that's what they're called. Oh, this is a whole water thing. That's hard. But have this whole place is like a little chill spot. Yeet. Fuck. Oh, I got it. Yes, sir. Bluegill, keep and throw back. You know, feel me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's peaceful. Without the lumen thought that somebody is just like, is that somebody? Just like that. Yes, sir. Keep. They say whenever there's one carp, there's always more. And you're distracting me, so stop. I feel like that's somebody's head. But it's not. Who the hell is that? Is that that hiker dude? Oh, he's about to spin back and fuck all this up. All, all this up. Oh, shit. Come on. Yeah. 
This little nigga here difficult to grab. Fuck. You know, I think the old saying is right. A bad day of fishing is still better than a good day at work. Boy, you tweaking. But I know you saw that hiker dude over there. I saw his little green jacket. We're cooked. He followed us. We can't play with these hikers. Oh, yeah, that's way better. Got it. Keep. Yes, sir. Woohoo! Just one more carp left. You got this. Where is that? hiker dude is he close you gotta come up and just bow, bow, bow. shoot shit out of it easy keep yes sir we good now all right, Hart, looks like you we got three cards. Do you know, oh, do you want to head back and throw these in the oven for dinner? Hell yeah. Why the air just pop off like that? Why, why is the ambience popping off like that? The fuck? Oh, hell no. Nah. Why is the basement door open again? While I'm cleaning the fish do you mind prepping the marinade i'm not sure how to do it just take a bowl and throw in ginger paste cooking oil black pepper salt italian seasoning paprika and yogurt okay i don't understand a damn thing of what the fuck ginger paste cooking oil black pepper salt let's start with that first ginger paste cooking oil black pepper salt Fuck, bitch. Nope. Fuck it, we'll start with this. Okay. Oh, it's right here. Okay. Olive oil. Yeah, any other shit? Like what? I don't recall seeing no. Is that somebody? No. Okay. Paprika. Italian seasoning. Nope. Ginger page. Yeah. Uh, Italian seasoning. Yeah. Olive oil. Olive oil. Here we go. Uh huh. Black pep. Ugh. Black pepper. Where that at? Where that at? Nope. 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 Oh shit! It's over here. Right in my face. Uh huh. Uh huh. Boom. Say that. Here you go. Oh, do I just put it in there? Yeah. Yeah. Do you mind throwing the fish in the marinade in the casserole while I chop these veggies? I got you. 
I got you. Just not in the way you want. Okay. Put that right there. Deja vu. I'm getting deja vu. Oh my god. Y'all, y'all, I seen this I seen him before. That fish and shit, nigga, I seen this shit months ago. I had a dream about this months ago. Yo, this shit crazy. I re What is that? Oh. Let me uh boom. Boom. Yeah, two cards marinade. Where's your veggies? Now, could you add the veggies? Why you got me doing all the work? I read it read. Oh, I read it needs to go for 30 minutes at 400. Okay. Yo. Oh, so I didn't need to do that. So we ain't gonna speak on the fact that the, the basement is open again. Those carver are going to taste amazing. While we wait for it to cook, how about we play some board games? I saw some in the room. Oh, I saw some in the room next to the living room. I, I which one? Just grab whatever. Okay, let me see. Why you got me doing it? Room next to the living room. That's the living room, ain't it? What room? Oh, what the fuck? I ain't never been here. How do you know about this? Hell no. Nah. Oh, fuck no. Power stack, bitch. What about this one, bro? What about this one? Ah, tower stack. Nice choice, Harp. It's been ages since I played this. Totally. It's been long for me, too, shit. Okay, let's see how steady those hands are. Pause. Where are we playing that shit? If you go. Oh, we playing it right here by the basement there? Oh. Yeah, they goofy if they thought I was going to do the Ouija board shit. He probably going to say, I'm bored of this, and then he's going to. How the fuck? Oh. Light work. You're a pro harp, not really. Oh, lean. You know they call me the Tower Whisperer. You look goofy as shit like this. I'm gonna look around. I just realized that I can look. Well, I'm about to make life hard for you, buddy. So let's let me just go ahead and. Ooh. sir that move was smooth as butter okay all right time to channel my inner architect you're gross you know that right you disgust me man uh let's see let's see bitch i need do nothing well done, Harp. Amazing crash landing. Thank you. Let's give it another try. I'm just waiting for the bullshit to happen. I didn't even fucking do anything that last thing. They gonna blame me. That's crazy. I'll start from the... I'll play it safe. Oh, this is not safe. I'm 
moving fast. That's why I look like that. I'm sorry, y'all. You know? I've seen size... Oh, skyscrapers with less stability than your tower block. Nigga, your head look like it's a part of the tower block, blockhead bitch. Fucking come. Oh, I can't say that. I didn't look around and check my surroundings. This is not the same fucking... I drew a circle. I've seen skyscrapers with that... <sighs> look, look, your chin fit right in. Shut up, fat nose ass. Lean to the left, lean to the left, lean to the left. Time to channel my inner architect. Grace, you know that. Only try hard and because I refuse to accept that you're the only person that won. Harp, you're making this game look easy. This will be your downfall. Boom, another perfect move by yours truly. I'm not, not you're not mine, bro. I don't know you for real. I almost cooked myself, I ain't gonna lie. You're making this game look effortless. How did you do that? It looked like there's three, you're missing like, what, three? I despise you, I despise you, I despise you, I despise you, I despise you. You will be the downfall of this, I'm, it, what the fuck? Oh my god, I gotta let I gotta let him know. I gotta let my nuts hang. I gotta let my nuts hang. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Bitch ass, you know, yeah. You're dead, you're dead, you're dead. Lose already. You really outdone, oh my God, <laughs> please. I can't let him win. I can't let him win. I have to ratio this. Oh, come on, Ray. Annoy me. I'll play it safe. Fuck, I know y'all saw that. Come on. Come on. 
Yup, you feel me? Light work. What? That what you get, you cockeyed bastard? My bad. Man, losing to you makes me feel like a kid again. You want to do it again? Let's leave it. Let's leave it alone. That was a fun game. You really did well. Appreciate it. All right. The carp should be just about done. Let's grab some plates. I'm starving. What is that? Ew, did you just pick me up? Nigga? Like, what's going on? I think our show is about to come on. You want to watch it while you eat? Sure. Hmm. can't sit right here bro i don't want to sit next to you so you can put your little fishy nasty hands on me for no reason i have to uppercut you and then drag you behind your truck oh you want me to turn the tv on okay cowboy boots nigga like moves down the rivers like a mayonnaise water my bottle. nigga berlin so first we are going to prepare the asparagus yeah season these with a lot of salt. Salt is I gotta good get my for plate. the bones. After letting these simmer in the salt bath, we can start making the chocolate. And take a couple cocoa beans. Ah, uh, yes, the cocoa beans need to be blended into the sauce with a little bit of vinegar. Okay. Gotta keep that fancy flavor. Yeah, no. The next thing we prepare is the mayonnaise. mayonnaise. We stir fry this in a pan with Irish tofu. With hands? It's crazy. This is gonna taste like shit. Wow. But here you are, anyway, listening to my cooking instructions. This is the brain of the mayonnaise. We, we gotta inject it with a little anesthesia to make sure it doesn't revolt against us it wow it's very angry once it knows we're trying to cook it after doing that we mix all the ingredients Fair together lady. in a tray and place it inside the oven okay what was that? while that's cooking we can start on the appetizer this is all nasty. Gasoline soaked ramen. you ain't seasoning this shit right this right you think the sauce was just gonna season it only a dish only for experienced cooks. I blame this on you. It requires a lot of patience and skill. What you will need is oh, gasoline and ramen. Harp, that was this some damn fine really food. Twice as good since we caught the fish ourselves. Ooh, like like, you know? You don't have to rain on my parade, Harp. It was Begin no more pizza, but I thought it turned out well. Into this pot. Hey, anyways, sure I need to check my emails real quick. Left my laptop really upstairs. Thought we were taking a break from work. Oh, I, I chose the wrong thing. I exited. Okay. Do not use diesel. So after letting the gasoline come to a boil, we can put in our ramen. I'm using some stuff I found in my grandmama's basement. But you can use whatever kind you like. You know? This ramen will taste fantastic. The gasoline fully I had to do both our plates, man. Get this. It's actually kind of scientific. Bill Nye who? The gasoline molecules merge with the noodle molecules, and they taste very good. Now that this is cooking, we can check on our cake. The fuck? Um, uh, if your oven catches on fire, uh, make sure to put it out. With the fire extinguisher. Well, damn. Uh, uh, damn, that's burnt. Uh, this is about to be some shit. I I'm not eating this. Mm. But, but not to worry. I know someone. This said, damn, that shit burnt. I'm not gonna eat this. Yo, Grandma! Grandma? No, I made you food! Wow. No, 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 it's not, it's not poison. It's not poison. Look. Berlin. Uh, bye, Grandma! 
Wow. Stay in your room. I don't want you wandering around the house again. Crazy. Get back in there. I think there's someone under my bed right now. Can you come upstairs? Hey, okay, I'm glad she ate that up. I wouldn't want any food to go to waste. Anyways, I guess we can still enjoy our gasoline ramen, which is ready to serve. I hope y'all enjoy eating this as much as I will. Let's eat! I. Fuck you mean there's someone in your He's about to pull some fucking prank <sighs> Shit Walk slow Come upstairs don't make sense Walk slow Shit, bitch. Gotcha. See, you know what? Right, you lucky I ain't knock your bitch ass out. My good looks are half my charm, Harp. Your good looks? Your face look like it's doing the geometry dash, nigga. Half my charm, Harp. Don't mess with them. <sighs> I totally got you. That was fun, wasn't it, nigga? It's not cool, bro. Oh, that's cool, bro. Come on. It was just a joke. You're a joke, bro. You want to go for the next round? How about a game of hide and seek? Whatever you say, Sydney Arbor. Wow, the full government is crazy. What the f Oh, shit. You, you, you. I decided to hide in the basement. Are you stupid? No, I didn't. I'm hiding in his truck down the street. Home. <laughs> this woman don't listen for shit. I decided to hide in the nook under the stairs. Got you, ugly. Ugh. <laughs> that wasn't even a challenge. I figured you should. <laughs> you would be good at this since I never find you in the city. Maybe you need to look harder, though. All right, my turn to hide now. You better close your eyes and start counting. All right, bro. Oh, here is crazy. Fuck it. he ain't no in no dumb place well i pray he's in a dumb place i don't want to go into the bag i want to go outside he upstairs somewhere you're in the damn closet ain't you Yup. Is that him? Is that really him?
Is that him? I don't think that's him. Oh, got you. Hang on, Harp. I think I heard something upstairs. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice. You gonna try this shit again? Not nah, kidney, Sydney. I really kid. Uh, kidney? No kidding, Sydney. I really heard something sliding up here. You didn't hear that? No, I did not. I swear on my life, I heard something. I see this attic access in here. Oh no! Stop, dude. You're being nosy. Get in the truck and let's go. If you, I, th I thought I just heard something. All right, are you going to check it out? Me? You're taller than me. Why don't you go? All right. I think uh, my shoulders are too broad to fit through there, Sydney. But none of us really should look. Right, cause you 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 weak. Use that step stool behind you and climb up. We're not. I'm going in the fucking truck and we're leaving. Duh. Oh, <sighs> man, bitch. Okay, what place? Where? Where's the where's the damn attic access door? Is it in here? Yeah. I'm gonna have to get my shit rocked. <gasps> oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck. fuck! Sydney, are you okay? What's up? It was just a cat. Looks like you aren't the only one. Had to get it. What do you mean by that? It was just. <laughs> Oh, that's a relief. I was worried there for a minute. Maybe we can give her one of the carp after I come find you again. Shit, 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 shit. I decided to hide in the tool shed in the backyard. Oh, you lost your mind. She's going to the worst spots, man. The spots that I get her knocked off. Is the door closed all of a sudden? No, it's still open. We good. About to get snatched up. Okay. Who the fuck was that? I know y'all saw that. What's good, bro? Aha, uh -huh, there you are. Damn, Harp. It took me a while to figure out you left the house. Anything we're doing is, I guess. I'm getting tired. I'm talking about some pretty eyes, niggas. I'll hide in the house. We're headed back anyway. You find me and we'll go to bed. Dude, you're so childish. Cheat shit. Ah. ah. I hope he can go back in that dingy ass basement again. The fuck? Oh, that's the shit I left. Now 
Now the game is broken. Well, come on, man. How about we don't do this right now? There. I just find them spread like butter in my bed. Had to shuffle in here. Oh, fuck. Who the fuck are you? What's going on? What happened? Well, hey there. Why the hell are you in here again, Rick? Or why are you back? What are you doing with the hammer? I'm fixing the faucet. You got a problem with that? You should have told us. Miss, this is my house. I don't need to check in with you every time I fix something. I've never seen anyone fix a faucet with a hammer before. You ever fixed many... Oh, you ever fixed many faucets yourself, young man? Didn't think so. So I'd imagine you don't know what tools you need. How long have you been here? Just got here a couple minutes ago. If you heard anything before that, it must have been that old lady, remember? <laughs> Do you think maybe you could fix it tomorrow? You're asking me to leave, miss? No, Rick, she's being polite. We rented this house and would like to have it to ourselves. I, We don't really want to have to call law enforcement. Like, please let me handle this. You weak, boy. Ain't no cops in Woodbury, son. You think they're going to arrest the homeowner for fixing the faucet? I was just doing some work. If you can't handle that, it's not your pro It's your problem, not mine. You know what? If your folks don't like me fixing the faucet, I'll leave it to you. I'll leave you to it. Boy, in all black with a hammer, what the fuck was you actually doing? The tap didn't work. I'm watching you leave. I'll make sure your Hank Hill looking ass gets the fuck up out of here. Uh-huh. After locking the door, we debated what to do. We agreed that there was something off about Rick from the start. It seemed like he enjoyed making excuses to come over unannounced. In the end, we decided Rick was weird, but probably harmless. We attributed, yeah, we attributed his behavior to an extreme lack of social awareness. Look, we already drove all the way out here. Let's just enjoy ourselves, Mike said. But by this time, I was feeling really tired. I decided to get some rest. 11.39 p.m. Oh, fuck, it's almost midnight. Who the hell knocking on the door like they crazy? Bro, what do you want? Oh, who the fuck are you? Nope. Oh, Harp, are you still awake? Hard to sleep when someone's knocking on the door. Do you mind if I come in? I'd like to talk about something. Sure, nigga. Oh, hell no. Nah. What's up, bro? Nigga, you got a diaper on? What's up? What do you want? Oh, shit. Mike was in the room, couldn't sleep. The storm is starting to get really bad. I can hardly see the truck in the driveway. I hope Nora is okay. Right, what the fuck? Where is Nora? She'll be just fine, Sydney. Don't worry. I'm here to keep you safe. Okay. Hey, it's no problem at all. Guys are supposed to watch over people they care about, right? Hey, what are you talking about? Man, fuck it. You know? What a day, huh? This wasn't exactly how I thought our getaway was going to go, Sydney. It's been a strange day. Can you believe that guy? He just keeps wandering around like the house 
like he owns the place. Well, he does own the place now. You know exactly what I meant, Sydney. He just shouldn't be just bar. Oh, whoa, I'm fucking up all the ly lines, lyrics. Wow. You know exactly what I meant, Sydney. He should have just barged in the place whenever he wants. We rented the damn house. I mean, the guy is probably harmless, but like, you know, I'm frustrated. Shit. You've also, oh, tell him about himself. I would. I'm gonna just hit me too, Nick. I really need to sleep now, Mike. It'll help if we both get some sleep, Nick. Uh-uh, fuck is you doing? Why don't you come sit by me, Sydney? Nigga, what? Fuck is you trying to do? Heart, you know. I've missed this. Ew. Us just talking. It's been too long. You know, you don't have to sleep alone tonight if you don't want to. Mike, where is this coming from? Would you be doing this if Nora was here? Right. Oh, yeah, you a little slut. Move. Get out of my face, nigga. Move. Freak ass. Your dog. Move. You act like you don't remember our trip to Oregon. I remember it being pretty awkward. I do remember it. Really. With. It's pro it probably was awkward fucking with you. I heard how you spoke on the phone, boy. It didn't start out awkward, though. Mike, we had a lot to drink. Things happened. They sure did. I'm hoping maybe they can happen again. What the fuck? Oh. Oh, Mike, I don't know what to say. I guess I've been meaning to talk to you about that. No, I really don't know. Well, I'm I'm scared that she's going to agree with them with this. I don't want her to be with this nigga, bro. I don't want her. Uh, uh. I don't want her to be. Uh, I don't even know what to say. I don't want nothing to do with this nigga, bro. But he probably going to side with the killer. He probably is the killer. The plot twist is probably him. He just brought me over here. That's probably what happened. Maybe that can happen again. Uh. You just let me worry about the details, Sydney Mike. I don't think that is a good time. Yeah, it, it. Whose phone is that? Guys, I think I'm about 70 miles away from Woodbury and my stinking tire just blew out. Oh, it's hell. snowing and I'm on the side of the road on Highway 11 near Killington. There's a sign by the side of the road. It's hard to see. I I think it says Kent Pond. The snow is like half of a deep and I can't get the lug nuts off the tire. Nora. <laughs> I hate to ask, but can you two come get me? Wait a What a time with me, huh? But I guess we can't leave Nora stranded. Let me get dressed and I'll meet you downstairs. No, we can't. No, Sydney, you stay here. No, I want to go. Let me drive. Fuck. I always like doing nice things for you, Sydney. Bro, get the fuck out. Get out. Leave. We'll finish talking about this later, okay? If you feel like we have to, we'll squash this shit like, immediately. I don't like you. Uh... Oh, I come down here. Why are all the lights off? Where the where the uh light switch? Please, where the light switch at? I don't know where the light switch at. Hey, why don't you get some rest while I'm gone? Uh, are you sure it's safe to drive in this weather, bro? Yeah, I think I'll crash for a bit, man. Fuck. Look, make sure you take care of yourself, all right? Lock all the doors. I got you. Before I go, how about a hug? I mean, just in case you're asleep when I get back, I kind of need one. 
Oh, fuck. You know what, nigga? You know what? I'll let you gas yourself up and break your heart when you get back, nigga. Sweet dreams. Fuck on my face. Freak ass, nigga. Nigga just wants some ass. Go talk to Nora. She sound cute. Told myself things would get better if I could just get some rest. Okay. Yep. Nora always knew how to cheer me up. I needed it more by the minute. With her arriving soon, I decided to rest in the meantime. About midnight. Well, it is midnight. Like, you know. Let's get up. Okay. Let's just go ahead. Oh, it's at the front door. Knowing me. I'm not gonna answer it right away. Let's see who's at the front door. Damn, bang out the door like the fucking police. What's wrong with you? Oh, hell no. Do I answer it? Do I hide? Can I hide? It's that fucking nigga. He gonna pull up. On, hold on. I need a knife. He gonna get diced up fucking with me. Is he still there? He's still knocking on the door like the police. Fuck it. We gonna answer it. We real ones. Look, friend. I know it ain't ideal banging on your door in the middle of the night, but I'm in a bad spot here. I was counting on a ride from some friends, but they are running behind and won't be here for about two hours. Nigga, you can sit on the porch. Thanks, but I was hoping you let me wait inside until my friends get here to get me. You're not coming in. Sorry, nigga. Are you fucking kidding me? Damn, you're going to let me freeze to death out here? I didn't make you go hiking in a snowstorm, right, dumbass nigga? I should have known you'd be as big a bitch here as you were back at the pizza joint. Nigga, what? You think I didn't see you and your little boyfriend fishing in the creek earlier? I figured maybe you'd give me a chance this time, but looks like you're still unkind. Bro, listen here, bro. Listen, bro. Just get the fuck off the porch, please. Ain't no cops around here. Speaking of, I don't see your fella's truck out here either. I'm dialing 911. Fine. Do it yourself. What the fuck are you talking about? I'll open this door and beat your ass. Hold on. I knew I saw his ass earlier. But let me tell you something. You'll get what's coming to you for leaving me out here. Karma's a bitch, my friend. You karma? That what you trying to say? The man at the door seemed irrelevant compared to how tired I was. Right, like, come on now, you ain't scaring nobody. I couldn't keep my eyes open. I had to get some sleep. And that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Fuck. <laughs> what that nigga thought he was scaring? Like, come on now. Banging on the door like police. That closet about to open. <gasps> oh, shit. What the fuck was that? The fuck was that? Did he hit that nigga with the truck? Is that what happened? At this point, I had no choice but to call for help. So what do I do now? Do I go down there?
Oh. Oh. Despite how strange Rick has been, seeing him was then a was a uh, seeing him then was a relief. Open the door, miss. It's me. What's up, bro? What the hell's going on here? Oh, thank God you're here, Rick. I'm glad you came, bro. Explain the situation. Blah 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 blah. Weird ass nigga was knocking on the door, right? And then like he was banging on it like police, fam. Like he was almost gonna bust your window for real, right? And he followed us all the way from like the pizza, you know, Moe's down the block, you know, like turn rough, like off of like what I think like eighty, you feel me? Like Rue eighty, you know? To he was over here like just like, hey man, let me get in the ride, right? You know? We only got two. I was about to be nice, right? But you already talked to Mike. You see how Mike is a little stupid bitch, right? So, yeah, Mike was like, no, nah, because there's only two seats and you suck, bro. And all that sort of stuff. And he was like, all right, bet I got some for you. And then he t took all that anger out on me because Mike said no, nah, right? And then he knocked on the door and he was like, let me in. It's cold. And I was like, we can't let you in. This ain't our house. And he was like, bitch, I don't give a fuck who house this is. Just let me in there. Because if you don't let me in there, shit ain't going to go well for you. And I was like, nigga, shut your ass up. I'm too tired to deal with you, bitch ass. Nigga, like, what? Come on now. I'm going to call somebody and they're going to come over here and fuck you up. And he was like, man, I don't give a fuck about nobody fucking. Like, I don't give a fuck about nobody coming over here, boy. I don't, I don't see your truck not here. So I know you by yourself. Watch, when, watch what happens to you. Next, you know, I go to bed because I ain't standing with that dude talking about. I hear somebody yell sound like gunshots i just hear bow right and hear somebody yell and then next you know something hits the window and i think it was a snowball i think dude trying to play right so like yeah i'm gonna need you to handle that yeah i came as quickly as i could i wouldn't worry about him anymore appreciate that oh shit yes sir oh by the way Where's your friend? The guy who was with you earlier. He should be back soon. Hmm. So you're all alone here right now, huh? Yeah, my friends will be back soon. What the fuck? Storms like this bring out all kinds of folks. Not all of them know when to stay away. Well, let's turn this TV Terrence, on. Shit. Do you have a dog? No. Well, you're in luck, cause here at Larry's come, Auto come back over. What do you mean? I've never been and I haven't been to the rental in weeks. Party? Hey, hold on. What you doing? 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 Hey, bro. I didn't feel safe over there, Lord. What's up with you? Everything okay? Yeah, we good. Awful late for texting is and who you talking to? My friends, you know. Is that so? Yeah. Thanks for coming by, though. I'll be fine now. You can head back if you want. I'll be fine now. You sure about that? Yeah. I'll react it. Maybe I should stick around. Make sure everything's really okay. You know what? You need to leave, bro. What did you just say? You heard what I said? You need to get your ass on for a kick rocks. Nigga, beat the traffic, ho. This is my fucking house. I will leave when I want to. Bro. All right, bro. Nigga, I'll say this one more time. Get out before I call the police, bro. I don't think so. If anyone is leaving this house, it will be one of us. What the fuck? <laughs> Damn. What did you say? You heard what I said? Nigga, who are you, bro? I want what's mine. This house and you. Ew.
What's up? Oh, I just killed. Yep, I killed myself. Fuck it, we gonna risk it. Get your ass out the way. Nora, hi! <laughs> hi! I told them everything that happened after Mike had left. Rick called the cops. The storm had quieted down by the time they arrived. And of course, the man was nowhere to be seen. On our drive back, the whole night played over and over in my head. We think that the man we saw secretly lived in the cabin when it wasn't being used and planned on robbing us during our stay. Oh, shit. 
but cops seemed to think there was more intent behind this man's actions aside from just robbing us. Rick asked me what the man looked like and after that he had didn't ask any more questions. We think he knew more than he was letting on. But in the end, he gave us a full refund. Yes, sir. W. Rick. Fuck it. He was, ain't got to interact with him no more. Survivor. Achievement unlocked. Hey. 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 Nora Lily. Okay. Queso and I'm Dante. I knew it. But the K Yeah. I should have went in that basement from the front. See what happened. Oh yeah, that's hard. I knew what those voices seemed familiar to me. Ray L, L did his thing again. Lord, oh shit. Another dub for the Rays. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thank you for letting me play it, man. And thank y'all for watching. This has been Fears to Fathom, Woodbury Gateway. Oh, yeah, Getaway. I said Gateway again. Woodbury Gateway. Wait, is it Getaway or Gateway? Oh, yeah, Woodbury Getaway, you know. Appreciate y'all for watching, you know. Be sure to do all the like, comment, subscribe, and, uh, you know. Carry it. Let's go ahead and get that Sleeping Dogs, you know, series going on. You know, go ahead and run that video up. Go ahead and sub to the uh, music channel. We're about to hit 400 there. Let's go ahead and get this channel to 200, you know. Much love, y'all. Dendy, get them out of here. Let them get home safe, man. Bye, y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.